Hi everyone, I'm Dhruv Varoda from Technosis. Today we are going to discuss something very important, something not many people discuss, not many people talk about, but uh, it's really, really important. Basically, we are going to discuss about universal anti-vibration mounts. So I have different kind of mounts. I have some flight controllers. I have some cameras along with me. So let's discuss what exactly works and what exactly doesn't work. I must tell you one thing that whatever I'm going to say is based purely on my experience. It does not have to promote or criticize any product. That is not our motto. Our main motto is to share our own experience with you guys. So I'll first discuss about the universal anti-vibration mounts for flight controllers. I have these three flight controllers. This is a Pixhawk, this is a Naze 32 and this is a Hobby King KK2. Normally what people do is they use these kind of foams and all you know. Uh, this one comes along with APM as well and these kind of general foams are available in the market. And this is an orange latex foam. So a lot of people just install their flight controller right on top of the foam and they think that is going to work well for them which is normally not true you have to have some kind of an anti-vibration mount something like these which are there so let me just discuss this one is one of the most commonly available anti-vibration mount i'm sure your people are aware of it and this is made of glass fiber and has some dampers here uh, personally i'm very fond of this one but I would not say this is the best one available but yeah if you have this mount I think it should do your job for almost all flight controllers this one is again made of glass fiber this one is easily available on hobbyking.com uh, honestly I am not very fond of this mount because it has too much of damping here as I mean in layman's words it, this thing is too 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 uh, flexible and I, I, I don't think this is a very good idea for a flight controller this is something like uh, that we have made by ourselves these are basically battery mounts of tarot we have put 100 gram uh, dampers here and this works perfectly we've been using this for with Pixaw and this actually works perfectly so maybe you guys can look into this option for me this works I mean, this is just amazing for me for different cameras uh, again these kind of mounts are there and if you're not using a gimbal you need some kind of an anti-vibration to you know get rid of that jello effect and sometimes you do have a lot of vibrations in your multi-copter then again you need something like this in case you're not using a gimbal I would recommend that you go for a mount which is something like this because as I said this is much much more flexible this really works well with something like a Mobius it is a perfect fit as well for the camera this one I would not recommend because then it does not eliminate the vibrations and you will still get a lot of jello effect this one again works quite well with the cameras but I will take it as a second option to this one we are also having this uh, Tony G Wi-Fi action camera and it can again be used on these very easily it fits very well you can put it like this you can put it like this the way you want you can do it honestly telling you a lot of people don't take this thing very seriously but it is very very important and if you guys are choosing or are going to purchase any of these universal anti-vibration mounts I would recommend that you choose carefully because they do make a difference take care happy flying